are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. As today's Bible, December 26, 2021, this is preached by Pastor Joseph Park. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's English ministry message, Beyond the New Year, 3 Peter chapter 1, verse 1 through 13. Beloved, I now write to you the second episode, in both of which I stir up your pure minds by way of reminder, that you may be mindful of the words which were spoken before by the holy prophets and the commandments of us, the apostles of the Lord and Savior, knowing this first, that scoffers will come in the last days walking according to their own lust, and saying, where is the promise of his coming? For since the fathers fell asleep, all things continue as they were from the beginning of creation. For this they willfully forget, that by the word of God the heavens were of old and the earth standing out of water and in the water, by which the world that then existed perished being flooded with water. But the heavens and the earth which are now preserved by the same word, and are reserved of, for fire until the day of judgment and peridion of ungodly men. But, beloved, do not forget this one thing, that with the Lord one day is as a thousand years, and a thousand years as one day. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some count slackness, but is long-suffering towards us, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance, the day of the Lord. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in which the heavens will pass away with a great noise, and the elements will melt with fervent heat. Both the earth and the works that are in, in it will be burned up. Therefore, since all these things will be dissolved, what manner of persons ought you to be in holy conduct and godliness? Looking for and hastening the coming of the day of God, because of which the heavens will be dissolved, being on fire, and the elements will melt with fervent heat? Nevertheless, we, according to his promise, look for new heavens and a new earth in which righteousness dwells. You are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. As today's Bible, December 26, 2021, this is preached by Pastor Joseph Park. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's English ministry message, Beyond the New Year, 3 Peter chapter 1, verse 1 through 13. Beloved, I now write to you the second episode, in both of which I stir up your pure minds by way of reminder, that you may be mindful of the words which were spoken before by the holy prophets and the commandments of us, the apostles of the Lord and Savior, knowing this first, that scoffers will come in the last days walking according to their own lust, and saying, Where is the promise of his coming? For since the fathers fell asleep, all things continue as they were from the beginning of creation. For this they willfully forget that by the word of God the heavens were of old in the earth standing out of water and in the water, by which the world that then existed perished being flooded with water. But the heavens and the earth, which are now preserved by the same word and are reserved of, for fire until the day of judgment, and Peridian of ungodly men. But, beloved, do not forget this one thing, that with the Lord one day is as a thousand years, 
and a thousand years as one day. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some count slackness, but is long suffering towards us, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. The day of the Lord. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in which the heavens will pass away with a great noise, and the elements will melt with fervent heat. Both the earth and the works that are in, in it will be burned up. Therefore, since all these things will be dissolved, what manner of persons ought you to be in holy conduct and godliness? Looking for and hastening the coming of the day of God, because of which the heavens will be dissolved, being on fire, and the elements will melt with fervent heat? Nevertheless, we, according to his promise, look for new heavens and a new earth in which righteousness dwells. You are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. Of today's Bible, December 26, 2021, this be by Pastor David Shen. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's children's message, Jesus is my Savior. Luke chapter 2, verse 21 to 38. And when eight days were completed for the circumcision of the child, his name was called Jesus, the name given by the angel before he was conceived in the womb, Jesus presented in the temple. Now when the days of her purification according to the law of Moses were completed, they brought him to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord, as it is written in the law of the Lord. Every male who opens the womb shall be called holy to the Lord, and to offer a sacrifice according to what is said in the law of the Lord. A pair of turtle doves, or two young pigeons, Simon sees God's salvation. And behold, there was a man in Jerusalem whose name was Simon, and this man was just and devout waiting for the consolation of Israel, and the Holy Spirit was ab upon him. And it had been revealed to him by the Holy Spirit that he would not see death before he had seen the Lord's Christ. So he came by the Spirit into the temple, and when the parents brought in the child Jesus to do for him according to the custom of the law, he took him up in his arms and blessed God and said, Lord, now you are letting your servant depart in peace, according to your word. For my eyes have seen your salvation, which you have prepared before the face of all peoples, a light to bring revelation to the Gentiles, and the glory of your people Israel. And Joseph and his mother marveled at those things which were spoken of him. Then Simon blessed them and said to Mary, his mother, Behold, this child is destined for the fall and rising of many in Israel, and for a sign which will be broken against thirty-five. Yes, a sword will pierce through your own soul also, and the thoughts of many hearts will be revealed. Now there was one, Anna, a prophetess, the daughter of Phanel of the tribe Azure. She was of a great age and had lived with a husband seven years from her virginity. And this woman was a widow of about 84 years who did not depart from the temple but served God with fasting and prayers night and day. And coming in that instant, she gave thanks to the Lord and spoke to him to all those who look for redemption in Jerusalem. You are listening to KZT 
Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. As today's Bible, December 26, 2021, this brief by Pastor June Park. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's youth message, Reflection and Resolution, 2 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 5. Examine yourselves to see whether you are in the faith. Test yourselves, or do you not realize this about yourselves, that Jesus Christ is in you, unless indeed you fail to meet the test.